How's it going everybody? My name is MDK, WLAN, otherwise known as MDK, and today we're in Windows 8.1. And I stumbled upon this while trying to make Windows 8 a little bit better. Um, like I said in the past, I am essentially operating system agnostic. I don't, I'm not swayed one way or the other. Uh, I use Windows 8 or Microsoft's operating system when I have to, and Mainly, the only reason I have to anymore is because of AAA games. Pretty much uh, anything else I can do in Linux, but either way, it doesn't really matter to me. If I have to use Windows, I have to use Windows. So be it. Anyway, I came upon this functionality in Windows 8 that was very useful because I'm not a giant fan of Metro. So. Uh, currently, the point release for Windows 8.1 is still free, and I believe it will remain free. Um, not 100% sure on that. So, if make, you know if you have Windows 8, make sure you have the 8.1 update. Um, you can you know, do uh, Windows key R, do MS info 32, and it should tell you Microsoft Windows 8.1 Pro. That's at least what I have, and you can see my system specs. So. As long as it says uh, Windows 8.1, you're golden for this. So taskbar, uh, right-click on the taskbar. Make sure that uh, taskbar and navigation properties come up. Just right-click and go to properties, and go to navigation. Uh, I am fairly certain this was added in Windows 8.1. If not, it was probably added in some service pack update. That's, I guess, it's really not a service pack update. Anyway, some update of functionality of Windows that doesn't make sense to me, but makes sense to them. Um, currently, I have them all turned on, but you can go through and disable, enable, whatever you want. Um, my two favorite are the um, ability to boot right into desktop and not even see Mate or see Metro at all. I have Linux on the mind. So you don't see Metro at all, it just goes right to desktop, and then another functionality is changing um, how Windows key works, or the super key, uh, so that when you press it, it rather than, it would normally take you to the um, Metro interface. Now it does this, it takes me to my apps window, where I can load anything, and then if I just start typing, uh, it will show there. See so Steam and then anything to do with Steam. So that's a good functionality in my opinion and it's very useful. Uh, but those two within itself just made my experience in Windows 8 a lot better. So hopefully that was helpful and hopefully it was worded well enough that you can understand me. But apart from that, hope you guys have a good one. Take care.